I intend. I intend to be a queen. <laughs> when I grow up, I'm going to be the biggest queen there ever was. <laughs> and I'll live in a big palace with a big front lawn. <laughs> and I'll have lots of beautiful dresses to wear. And when I go out in my coach, the people will wave and I will shout at them. <laughs> and in the summertime, I'll go to my summer palace and I'll wear my crown even in swimming. <laughs> and the people will cheer and I will shout at them. <laughs> what do you mean I can't be a queen? <sighs> well, there must be a loophole. This sort of thing always has a loophole. Nobody should be kept from being a queen if they want to be one. But it's undemocratic. Usually, it's a matter of knowing the right people. <laughs> I bet a few pieces of well-placed correspondence. And I'll be queen in no time. <laughs> I know what I'll do. If I can't be a queen, then I'll be very rich. <laughs> I'll work and work and become very, very rich. And I'll buy myself a queendom. <laughs> yes, I'll buy myself a queendom and then I'll kick out the old queen and I'll take over the whole operation myself. And I'll be head queen. <laughs> and the people will. Oh, when I go out in my coach, the people will. Oh, I give up. I've decided to dedicate my life to cultivating my natural beauty.